What's going on guys? Today we have a really sophisticated scale. It is the SkyRC corner weight system to give you an accurate weight reading of your RC model. So we're gonna unbox this scale system and then we'll demonstrate its use. Depending on the type of driving you do and the RC model that you have, you may wanna set the weight up of the vehicle in a particular way. Now certain cars, like maybe an oval car, would want the weight bias left and right differently than say a 10 scale touring car for racing. Now RC vehicles all have different setups depending on their use. So this Sky RC corner weight scale is a really handy product to have, even for RC crawler guys who are looking for their front to rear weight bias. The corner weight system is basically a main hub and then it has four separate scales that plug into the main hub. So we have our instructions on the very top. Uh, here is our unit. Take it out here in a moment. And then underneath, we have the individual scales. There are four of them that plug into the main hub. And additionally, we have a DC cable that would plug into the hub and then you plug these two bullets into your power supply to power the corner weight system because it requires two AA batteries that are not included. So since that was all that was in the box, we have unraveled everything. Like I said, we have four independent scales and then here is our um, our scale hub, which will display all of our weights. Now, the nice thing about this is it displays in either grams or ounces. It has a tolerance down to a tenth of a gram or a hundredth of an ounce. And each scale will weigh up to 2,000 grams. Um, in total, that's a little over 17 pounds. So the scale system will work with your eight scale buggies and truggies, your 10th scale, and of course, everything below that. So to connect in our scales, they are color coordinated here with a little tag on the wire that corresponds to the color uh, of the display. So this particular scale is the rear right. So I'm gonna try to set this up so it's in reverse for me, but I can put up the display for you guys. All right, I've got the scales all set up how I think they should be. On the hub, I wanted to point out there's only three physical buttons on here. You have a, a zero out button if you need to zero out the weights. There is an on off, you just hold the button down to press it. And then there is the unit button to switch from grams and ounces. So we're gonna turn it on. Everything should be zeroed out and it looks like it is. So I'm gonna set that down for a moment. Let's put the car on the weights. It looks about right. Okay, and here we have our display. I actually have the car on here backwards. Okay, we have the car on the scale. As you can see, we have a lot of information on our hub right here. The center screen in the yellow, that is gonna be our total weight all together. And then we have our corners. So each of these corner displays at the corner of our hub is showing what that particular corner is. So this top one here is the front right, which is this corner right here for me. And then down below, that would be the front left, the rear right, and then down here is the rear left. Now we have our left and right weight biases right here in um, grams as well as in a percentage. And then also for the front to rear weight bias, we also have that provided with a rear weight of, what's it say, 758 grams and the front is 838 so this particular model has a lot more weight in the front it says that 53 percent of the weight is in front with 47 in the rear so there's quite a bit of bias there in the front to rear and then our left to right it looks like that is also well actually it's 50 50 but the grams are a little off but as a percentage it's about a 50 50. 
All right, guys, you can see that with all this information, it's really handy in knowing how your car is set up and then in altering it if you need to make changes. Oval guys would want their left to right weight bias differently than say a 10 scale touring car where you want that vehicle very balanced. Now a rock crawler, this would be good to know what your front to rear weight bias is and if you should correct it. There is a lot of uses for the corner weight scale system. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed this video of the Sky RC corner weight system. It is a very versatile versatile precision scale system that suits a variety of needs. If you have any questions or comments, please leave that for us down below. And if you would like more information, we have some links down below as well. My name is Brett with A-Main Hobbies. Thanks for watching.